Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Sahil and in today's video we'll have a look at the Sony's XM4 headphones. The XM3s which released back in 2018 still have the crown for the best noise cancelling headphones of all time. And since it's almost been 2 years since their release, Sony is prepping a brand new pair of noise cancelling headphones likely to be called the WH-1000XM4. Starting with the design, and not much has changed in terms of design from the XM3s. The XM3s already had a great design and were also known to be really comfortable headphones. However, the XM4 will sport slightly larger ear cups and cushions, hopefully making them even more comfortable. Let's get to the big deal now, shall we? Sony's XM4s will finally be able to connect to more than one device at once, allowing you to quickly switch between them. Yes! After years of waiting, we finally get to see multi-device support in Sony's flagship headphones. However, there are two caveats to this. The first one is that this appears to be limited only to two devices. So you cannot switch between more than two devices with the multi-point Bluetooth support. It should actually be called two-point Bluetooth or dual device support. Anyway, the next downside is that the APK suggests the high-res audio LDAC codec won't be available when pairing to multiple devices. So you'll only be able to use the LDAC codec when connected to a single device. Not really a big deal, right? But these downsides do keep the XM4s from being the perfect headphones in my opinion. The XM4s will also feature Bluetooth 5, which is an obvious upgrade as the latest standard and will bring improved wireless range and more reliable connectivity. And it looks like the audio quality will also be improved. The teardown of the Sony Connect app revealed code for something called DSEE Extreme. DSE stands for Digital Sound Enhancement Engine, therefore DSEEE stands for Digital Sound Enhancement Engine Extreme. The Sony XM3s already use a feature called DSEE to upscale sound sources to higher quality. And this is likely an upgraded version of that technology hopefully translating to even better audio quality. A new feature that will be built into the XM4 will be called Speak to Chat. This is a smart talking feature that will allow the XM4 to detect a voice or phrase and automatically enable ambient sound, allowing environmental noise to pass through the headphones so you can hear the conversation without removing your headphones. And if the headphones detect that the conversation has ended, they'll just fade the noise cancellation back up. Smart talking sounds really cool, but it's unclear how the XM4s will handle this when surrounded by lots of voices, for example in like an office or in a public area. The findings also suggest that the XM4s will be one of the smartest pairs of headphones ever seen, with some interesting location features. Using a Google Maps API, the headphones will be able to change your settings based on where you are. That's pretty handy if you want for example, different noise cancelling settings for home and the office. Coming to battery life, the power consumption is listed at just 2 watts, meaning the XM4s will have a much longer battery life. The improvement will be substantial and sources say that the battery life will be extended to 40 hours of usage, which is amazing considering the XM3's 30 hour battery life. Wrapping up, Sony's XM4s will possibly be the best headphones you can find in the market when they release. And although not being that different from the XM3s, the small improvements will provide a solid upgrade to the overall pair of headphones. They will be priced at least at $349 and should be released before the end of this year. I also made a comparison video between the Microsoft Surface Headphones 2 and Sony's XM3s, so check that out if you're interested. Also be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And with that said, I'll catch you guys in the next video.